what's up? This is Jordan Wagner with PremierGuitar.com, and I'm here with the new Way Huge Green Rhino Mark II Overdrive. So, the Green Rhino Mark II is a reissue of one of the most famous pedals out of the original Way Huge line. Uh, it's definitely been one of the most requested reissues from that, from that era. Um, this is actually the third iteration of the Green Rhino pedal. Originally, there was the Green Rhino Overdrive, then the Green Rhino Overdrive II which came shortly thereafter in the 90s. And uh, now this is the Green Rhino Mark II. And it's pretty much exactly the same as far as the control scheme goes out, except for two additional controls. We'll start with volume, drive, overdrive, uh, tone, and there is a curve knob right now, which kind of rolls off or softens your high frequencies a little bit. And the 100 hertz booster cut this is a really, really, really cool addition to this pedal. Um, you can cut it or boost it by 12 decibels, um, effectively making it great for you know, uh, more guttural guitar, guitar tones or even bass overdrive, which with bass, it sounds just fantastic. It was actually one of the funnest times I had playing this pedal. Now, the Green Rhino Overdrive pretty much takes a page out of the Tube Screamer Overdrive book, um, kind of bluesy you know, hot rotted overdrive. One of the frustrations that a lot of people have with the Tube Screamer circuit is how it kind of cuts out the low end. Uh, handles the mid range and high end obviously very, very well, but the low end cut is something that just really, really, really grates on a lot of players' nerves, um, which is part of the reason why you see an awful lot of, of uh, uh, Tube Screamer um, alternatives and modifications available to try to correct that problem. The Green Rhino tries to affect the, uh, the low end cut issue by having the uh, 100 hertz boost and cut, so you can kind of tailor it towards just how much natural low end response your amp and guitar combination has. So here I'm gonna play a couple things and move the knob around so you can kind of get, you know, get more of a, a sense of the amount of difference between um, different settings. So the rig I'm playing through right now is an orange TH30 twin channel all tube head with a matching orange PPC 410 cabinet. This combination is really, really, really nice for classic rock, blues, things of that nature. And it has a pretty honest clean channel. So a lot of you might wonder just how much of this tone is from the orange and how much is from the green rhino. Um, the orange is a killer amp, but uh, in this demonstration, a lot of this is straight up from the Green Rhino. So I'm going to play just an open G chord to kind of give you an idea with the pedal bypassed and with it on. Right now I have the Green Rhino Overdrive set up for a pretty high gain tone. Uh, the 100 hertz and curve knobs are at noon. And uh, I'm just going to play a riff and kind of show you the difference between uh, different settings right here so you can kind of get a sense of it. So now I'm going to cut the 100 hertz knob down to, I'd say, uh, about 10 o'clock and uh, adjust the curve up a little bit higher to about 2 o'clock. Now I'm going to play around with the pedal a little bit more to kind of show you the touch sensitivity capabilities of it. One thing you might notice from so far with me playing is that the curve knob might not have a very noticeable effect on the tone. It's actually quite subtle. Um, it just rolls off a slide end off the top frequencies that it smooths it out a little bit more. Now one thing that makes an overdrive pedal great is its ability to clean up with rolling down the guitar's tone or volume knob. Um, the Green Rhino Overdrive does it exceptionally well. Uh, and there's still a little bit of grit on the top end of it, but it still has that body and that definition that it has at full bore. So I'm going to play a short demonstration here, kind of simple to give you kind of an idea. I'm going to roll up my, vol my guitar's volume knob very, very slightly, and then I'm going to go full bore after that.
have it. That's the new WayHuge Green Rhino Mark II Overdrive. Um, you can read my full review online, the web edition of PremierGuitar.com for January 2011. And thanks for watching. This is Jordan Wagner, and you're watching PremierGuitar.com.